Well, some of the residents who are following the rules of the lockdown told our Charles Fisher what they've been doing instead. We are headed into another weekend of a lockdown, something that's become the norm. I guess many of you then have your weekend planned out. I'll be spending some time resting, um, praying, reading the Bible, also catching up on reading some other materials. I'm not a movie person, but I may catch up on, you know, a few movies to pass time a bit. So now my weekends consist of more video conferences rather than face-to-face -face meetings. Some of us have been using this time to find ourselves, so to speak. Time has allotted me the opportunity to think, meditate, focus and reconstruct how I must now formulate and manage finances and put in perspective the things that are most important. Thinking about family structure, budgeting, our economy as a nation, has shifted where I must now evaluate how to survive during this period of testing. One thing is for sure, if you want to get back to normal life, you will have to abide by the rules and stay home. Important and necessary if we are going to have success in beating this common enemy. The most important goal at this time is to prevent the spread of the disease in our country and allow us to return to a normal way of life that is safe for us all. If the weekend lockdowns are assisting the authorities in being able to make their detection and you know get a handle of this virus then I think it should be continued and um, everybody just follow the protocols, follow the rules, let us all cooperate, be safe, um, practice social distancing when you're out. Um, if you feel like you touch something that you shouldn't touch, wash your hands, wear your face mask in public, and let us all just be safe. Listen, it's only for a while, and guess what? You're going to save lives, and the life you save may very well be your own. So stay at home. Listen, we are our brother's keeper, and it all boils down to love. If you love your brother, you'll stay at home, Bahamas. Please be safe. So, what are your plans for this weekend? I'd like to know.